Unit Two, Animal Life, Chapter Three, Adaptation in Animals. Important terms: waterproofing, protection from water, extinct, disappeared, constant, fixed, scarce, small quality, delicate, sensitive, emerge to come out, predator, hunter, excrete, removal of waste. Blend, mix. Thousands of years ago, huge animals like dinosaurs and lizards lived on the earth. Now they do not exist. They have become extinct on the earth. These animals could not adapt themselves according to their changing environment. An animal should be able to protect itself and find food in order to live in its environment. When an animal is able to do so successfully. It is said to have adapted to its environment. All animals are adapted to live at a certain place. The place where an animal lives is called its habitat. A habitat can be on land, in water, in air, or on trees. Adaptation to environment. Terrestrial or land animals. Animals that live on land are called terrestrial animals. They have well-developed sense organs and nervous systems to adapt to their environment. They can be categorized into desert animals, polar animals, and grassland animals. Desert animals. The lack of water and extreme temperatures are the two main features of desert. These animals must adapt to. Many desert animals avoid heat by simply staying out of it as much as possible. Since water is very scarce, most desert animals get their water from the food they eat. Animals like kangaroo, rat, and lizard live in burrows. They stay inside during the day and emerge at night to feed themselves. The kidneys of desert animals concentrate urine so that they excrete less water. A camel can travel for a week or more without drinking water. And can last for several months without eating food. Camel's feet are wide, so they can walk on sand more easily. Polar animals. The areas around the northern and southern poles of the Earth are very cold regions. These places are called polar areas. The polar areas are covered by snow and ice in most parts of the year. The white fur of a polar bear helps it to blend in with snow and ice. They have a layer of fat under their skin and fur that helps them stay warm. The white and large paws help a polar bear walk in the snow. Penguins have webbed feet for doing powerful swimming. They have thick skin and lots of fat under their skin to keep themselves warm in cold weather. Their tightly packed feathers overlap to provide waterproofing and warmth. Musk ox, seal. And walrus are some other animals that have adapted themselves to these regions to survive. Polar bear, penguin, grassland animals, the sheep, horse, giraffe, zebra, kangaroo, and rhinoceros are some animals that have adapted themselves to the climate of a grassland to survive. Long necks of giraffes allow them to eat leaves or prey off and spot predators. Long and tough tongues enable them to pull leaves from branches without getting hurt by the thorns during the feeding process. Animals like snakes do not have legs. They have scales that help them to crawl. Animals like lizards and frogs sleep for several months to protect themselves from cold. This is called hibernation. Spectroscope: A giraffe can consume up to 12 gallons of water at one point of time. Its tongue can be up to 18 inches long. Giraffe, sheep, kangaroo, aquatic animals. Animals that live in water are called aquatic animals. Whale, shark, snail, octopus, turtle, crab, and fish are some of the aquatic animals. Most of their species live in water, and some of them live on land too. They have paired and unpaired fins. Which help them swim. They have either webbed limbs, duck, or limbs that are modified to paddles, turtle for swimming. Their body shape is streamlined. Fish, 
snake and whales, and their bones are light and spongy. Fish and crabs have gills that help them breathe in water. Shark possesses multiple gill openings. The neck is reduced and external ears are not present. Amphibians Animals that can live both on land and in water are called amphibians. They are cold-blooded animals. This means they do not have a constant body temperature. They adjust themselves with the temperature of their environment. Their moist and scaleless skin help them absorb water and oxygen. However, they also have lungs which help them to breathe on land. Frogs, toads, and alligators are amphibians that become inactive when the conditions are unfavorable for their survival. The period of inactivity is called estivation when it occurs during the hot and dry weather and is called hibernation when it occurs during the cold weather. Alligator Toad Aerial Animals Animals that fly are called aerial animals. They have wings with either feathers, most birds or large flaps of skin, bats to help them fly in the air. They have hollow bones and thin and delicate skeletons that keep their weight low. They have good eyesight as most birds have and hearing. Bat Arboreal animals These animals live on trees and tend to have long tails for maintaining their balance. They have good eyesight and hearing. Monkeys and crinozoans are some arboreal animals. They have claws or fingers for gripping branches and special toes that can stick to the vertical surfaces. Monkey Adaptation for food Animals can be classified into four groups according to the type of food they eat. Herbivores Plant-eating animals like cow, goat and giraffe have been classified as herbivores. They have sharp biting and strong grinding teeth. They have long and strong legs to travel over long distances in search of food. Cow Factoscope Some turtles can lay up to 100 eggs at a time. Carnivores Flesh-eating animals are called carnivores. A carnivore is a predator because it has to fight and catch its prey. Some carnivores like wolves hunt in groups. Cheetahs usually hunt alone. They have well-developed tearing teeth. Flesh-eating birds like eagles and vultures have strong feet and sharp beaks and claws to catch other animals. Carnivores insects like dragonfly hunt other small insects. Cheetah Omnivores Omnivores eat both plants and animals. Chickens are omnivores. They eat seed, but they can also eat worms. Human beings, bears, crows, and cockroaches are omnivores. Bears Parasites Organisms that live by drawing food from a host organism are called parasites. Mosquitoes, leeches, and bugs are parasites. They live on or inside the bodies of other animals to arrange their food. They have sucking tubes to suck blood from their hosts. Leeches and bugs Adaptation for survival the distinct feature of some animals enable them to protect themselves and live long enough to reproduce. Camouflage Camouflage is a method used by an animal to blend its color with its environment so that it cannot be seen easily. Grasshopper blends with the green color of leaves and grass. Caterpillars assume the green color of leaves. Zebras Tigers and leopards have stripes or spots on their bodies which help them merge or mix with vegetation and grass around them. Warning Coloration Insects that are brightly colored are often poisonous. The bright colors of caterpillar and ladybird beetle make them inedible. Poisonous Liquid Bugs, beetles, toads and frogs produce poisonous liquids that repel attackers. Mimicry Some insects like spiders copy the shape, color and habits of other animals like ants to protect themselves. Body Structure Porcupines have sharp spines to warn off their enemies. Turtles hide in their hard shells. Scorpions have harmful pincers and cows use their horns to protect themselves from enemies. 
grasshopper, porcupine, scorpion. Teachers note, adaptation can be best explained with the help of the internet. Fact file 1. The world has approximately 1 billion cattle, of which about 200 million belong to India. 2. For each one of 600 million people, there are about 200 million insects crawling or flying. Let's summarize. 1. Animals can be classified as terrestrial, aquatic, amphibian, arboreal, and aerial according to their habitat. 2. Animals that live on land are called terrestrial animals. 3. Animals migrate or hibernate to survive in cold weather conditions. 4. Animals survive under different conditions by adapting themselves to their environment. 5. Camouflage enables many animals to hide from their predators.